Spider-Man! Things just went from bad to each river on fire bad. That's... Well, okay. I'm on my way. We'll deal with Scorpion later. Responders are on site now, at least. <laughs> Police are still fishing, but there's no sign of them. Any luck upriver? Nothing but debris. Who are those guys? Whoever they are, they're packing some serious tech. And now they got all that, plus Scorpion and Lee. Hey, whatever they're planning, we'll find them. We'll stop them. Pete, when 
I saw Lee inside that ship. My powers. They... You think his energy got entangled with yours? I don't know, man. But it feels... volatile. Well, wherever Electric Blue came from, it saved the day back there. Hey. We'll put Lee back where he belongs. Promise. Don't leave me hanging. I'm trying to soak over here. Not on my watch. Come on. <laughs> You're too much, man. Get used to hearing that voice, man. Dropped you a pin. Wanna come through? Hey, I'm Glaren. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah. I was just giving you space after you got out. Hold on. That car's swerving all over the place. Wait a minute. Drive! Drive! Is there a street race I don't know about? and get it over with, Miles. Hey, do either one of you guys have a permit for those? Huh? Mike! Mike! He's still breathing, but I'll get him to a hospital. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chances. Ah, where am I? Spider-Man? 
Don't worry, I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, but we didn't know. They're for our brother, Les. We, we lost him a few years ago, and he always loved them. So we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Spider-Man? Wow. There. The staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look. Hey, just dropped Mike off. He thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. Bro, watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. Here's that nap time you ordered. <laughs> you look tired. I 
knew I heard it the first time. Never saw it coming. the noise again. Birthday, Lex. Was that you? Oh man. I hope Mike saw that from the hospital. Lex would have done it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. Hey Unc, I'm back. So like I was saying, I was trying to give you space. Tell me. Besides, we gotta settle some things. We do? See you soon, kid. Just go see him and get it over with, Mouse. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. into his shop because of all the articles about his new flavors, but his traditional ones would have kept me coming back. Sometimes a classic is a classic for a reason. That'll definitely work. Uh, 
I mean, if I was rich, I'd take advantage of that backdrop, too. I'd also be worried about constantly launching balls off the roof, but I guess they can afford it. The hell? They're trying to brand someone? Sorry, nobody's getting branded today. Guys, I felt like they came out of a cult. Better tell Pete about that. into the view and a few who work there freedom of speech is a beautiful thing but saying a thing over and over again doesn't make it true shouldn't tell Ma about how close I got to an almost exploding gas truck. Gotta do this with the mask on. Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. 
It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I called. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. Getting some? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm serious, Miles. I've heard this dude could turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? High school? College? Anyone you like? I don't know. So there is something. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. Uploaded some prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. Another gate. Sweet. Can't pull it open from down here. Decent prowler. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? Old suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Tech is right up their alley. I want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay, I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. <coughs> Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles, me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con. Está bien. Sí, Ma, todo bien. Estaba ayudando a Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Cómo está él? Está trotando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. 
Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. That's perfect for Robbie. NYC. The mecca of basketball. Sure, you can play it anywhere with just a ball in the net. But when you got the people in the apartment buildings watching, the other players trash talking. And the sound of rubber hitting asphalt? There's a reason they call it the city game. Miles, club fair, remember? You on your way? Oh, right, that's today. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon. Everyone's safe inside, and the fire department can take over. We're good. The city seems pretty quiet. Still no sign of Lee, or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. Chris was mine this time. next time. Sheesh! No way we can talk this out! <laughs> See what this crystal is. But I don't want you to worry. That's my job. Someone was keeping tabs on Marco. Disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what shouldn't be. Spider Man's there! Careful where you point that thing! There's no 
Swing you over to an ambulance. They'll fix you right up. Oh my god! Thank you! Just a little bit farther! Wasn't too rough of a trip. Take care. Bless you, Spider Man. will keep the truck stable until it's ready to unload. They save my butt every time. social media, and I can say a lot. It's helped so many businesses stay afloat here when they would have gone under a long time ago. Hey, Pete, you ready to come by the foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that gang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get the story up. Can I get back to you in a minute? <clears throat> so many puns, and I don't even know where to start. Any chance we make this easy? <laughs> 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 Yeah. 
now to see what's inside the crystal. Maybe I'm being paranoid, but everywhere I go, I see them too. Work, the corner store, in the park. They're tracking us. Marco made a lot of enemies. Wonder if they finally caught up to him. All right, I'm back. Where was I? Oh, yeah. Miles thinks he saw their leader. Some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Cultists trying to brand someone. You broke the flame's trust. And apparently you broke Let them go! Spider-Man! I'll destroy the unworthy! He's using whips like a coward! <laughs> There's an ambulance nearby. I can take you to it. You're a lifesaver. Thank you. We're close. You're doing great. Now you're in much better hands. Thanks a ton. Man, people really don't appreciate you enough. Pardon me. Good, good. You know, I saw an old Grand Master playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. was.
Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it. I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker. <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him... Aside for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place, right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you? You got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission to heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? <laughs> you must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator, the carnivorous bee wolf. So we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? This is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not hurt them. Oh, nice! Yes! Yep. Oh, yeah. Gotta protect the hive. Nice. Gotcha. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, I know. I think I'm getting the hang of this. I knew you'd be good at this. I'm in beesness. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work. 
using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh. Yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. <laughs> 